Hi, this is Leon with Green Residential. Today, I'm going to film a video on lockboxes. Um, lockboxes are a very common uh, practice in property management, and we use three common lockboxes, and we're gonna go through each of these three lockboxes to, to show you how you can access keys, how you can put the keys back in and lock the lockbox, and then how you can remove the lockbox from your door uh, if, if that's what you need. Um, the first lockbox that we use is a Sherlock lockbox. And the way this functions is the front door opens forward um, after you've entered the correct code. So on this lockbox, the code is zero, 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 zero. So you wanna make sure it lines up evenly across and then you can open the front access the keys um, one important thing to note is that sometimes the keys if there's multiple keys will get jammed and, and make it difficult to unlock so you want to shake the uh, the lock box to make sure that the keys are all free from the locking mechanism um, once you've taken the keys out you can close the lock box you'll um, access the house um, if you're uh, going to be staying in the house then you can actually switch the dial to lock the door again otherwise if you're going to be uh if you're showing the property and you need to you're going to leave you need to put the keys back in the in the lock box after you've locked the house and then change the dial so the front uh, compartment is now locked again now if you need to remove the lock box from the door then there's a separate code um, to unlock the latch. And so for this one, the code is 7777. You then can remove the latch and remove the lockbox from the door. You then close the latch uh, and you can change the code and then store it in you know, a kitchen compartment or somewhere uh, out of the way inside the house. Um, the next type of lockbox that we use is also made by Sherlock. It comes in multiple colors, either the blue, black, there's also a maroon one. This lockbox is slightly different from the first one. The uh, door to access the keys is on the side of the lockbox. So what you'll do is you will get an access code. You'll put that code here. So this one is 3333. Put that code in, make sure it's lined up all across the middle, and then go to the side. The key box will then open um, for you to take the keys out. Same issue with the first lock box. Sometimes if there's multiple keys in there, they can be jammed. Don't be afraid to shake it to uh, get the keys loose from the locking mechanism. Um, when you're putting the keys back in, put them inside, and then you close this door and change the code. So the door, you wanna make sure that the door is actually locked. Sometimes if you change the code before the lock, the, uh, the door is all the way down, um, it won't actually lock and it'll still slide open. So you just wanna confirm that it is locked. Um, for this model, the latch code, um, if you need to remove it uh, and, and the latch code's provided, you input the latch code here. Um, we just made up codes for this presentation. Um, you enter, enter the latch code evenly across. That will then cause this to be able to come up. Um, you remove it from the door and then you can pop it down, lock it, it's all back together and then you can store it somewhere out of the way. Um, the third and final uh, lock box that we use is a master lock lock box. And this one functions a little bit differently. Um, so if you're given a code, this one, let's say is zero, 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 zero. You enter it the same way across where it's even, everything's lining up and then you hit this little side button and then it opens the door. You can remove the keys. When you're done, you can put the keys back in. You can close it and then change the dial and lock it. If you need to access the latch, this one is a little bit different. You don't need to change the code here. There's actually a tab at the top of the lockbox that you can pull towards the inside of the lockbox and then it just releases the upper latch uh, to uh, to, to uh, reattach you just put, push it down and then you close the lockbox and then you can change the dial 
and you're all set. So that's Lockboxes 101. Um, it is probably one of the most common questions we get, um, either when people are moving into homes or they're trying to show the property. Um, so hopefully that, that helps you and you're able to, to gain access. Um, if not, feel free to contact our office and we'll be happy to help you. Have a great day.